All right, guys, I want to do a quick, simple video. A lot of you guys have been asking me how hard it is to hook a generator to a twice the ice machine, okay? I'm doing this video, it's very simple, okay? Um, you can get away with a 40 kW generator, 40 kW on three phase, okay? Now you look at a generator to tell the load, you look at the rating on the generator, and you look at the tag, look at three phase kilowatt, KW. This is a 47 KW, okay? So when we go through the load right here, you're going to see that I'm pulling about 31 KW right now. That will get down to about 28 kW after a while. Depending on what cycle the ice machine's in, it'll pull from 30, uh, 28 to 33. Okay, see how I'm burning 2.65 gallons per hour? This will run about three days, seven hours at this load that it has right now, which it has a 300 gallon fuel cell. So this is a nice generator for putting in an ice machine. Set it, goes for three days before you even have to take it and refuel it, okay? I'm running two Arctic Temp 1000s. All you have to do is lay your lines out like this. Uh, I've got cam lock connectors in here. Lay your lines out separately. Do not roll them out, okay? Uh, put your cam lock connectors on this end. And then in here, you run these right in and tag into the lugs that are the appropriate lugs inside your utility box. Make sure you shut your power off at the pole here before you connect anything to the generator. Uh, this hookup can be done for probably three or four hundred dollars. But once you have this box, and make sure, see I lock all my connections in there when I leave so nobody can tamper with my connections, okay? I lock all three boxes so nobody can accidentally come and flip a switch, okay? Lay your lines out separately so that they do not create a some sort of magnetic field. Um, I'm going to put my hub locks on my generator and I'm good to go. So I'm doing generator testing today. Um, you guys that are interested in doing a generator, just let me know. I've got several of them and I help people buy and sell generators. So this generator cost me probably about, well, 2.85 gallons an hour. Uh, at $3 a gallon, about $8, $9 an hour to run to make 520 pounds of ice. Um, during a hurricane, you'll sell that ice for about $4 a bag, which should net you about $2,400 a day income um, if you have two ice makers. So $2,400 a day, and you probably spend about $80, $90 a day on diesel. So it's very lucrative to have generators in the case of a hurricane but I just wanted to show you the simple hookup I'm gonna I've got some detailed pictures I'm gonna add also but uh, just want to show you how easy it is to run it twice the ice off of a 55 well this is a 47 kW generator but with one ice maker you only need a 25 kW generator with two ice makers you need a 40 kW generator that's it guys if you have any other questions about how to hook up your generator, please ask me. You can get all your cables. It's just two um, gauge welding cable. You can get all those. Uh, I, I can help you find cable pretty cheap. You get all your um, Hubble cam lock connectors from Stage Lighting in Jacksonville. They're about $15 per connector. It takes you about three or four minutes to install each connector to the end of the cable. Very easy setup. But once you're done, you just lock it up, 
I'm gonna go ahead and test this one here. I'm gonna let this one run all day. Just to make sure I don't have any glitches or problems. And uh, then I'm ready for the next hurricane uh, or the emergency backup power. You guys have a great day. If you have any questions, just message me and I can help you out. Thanks.